So January in the, in the auction business is always an interesting month. Uh, we get the year starts uh, kicking into touch and um, what starts happening is that uh, the guys start lining up to get all the auctions in. Uh, we had a feeling that this January would be busy, but it's really been an extremely busy period. I mean, normally it starts off quite slowly, but this January, uh, the business has been ex extremely busy. In fact, I feel like I need a holiday. And uh, the reason is that there, there seems to be, a, the banks seem to be clearing out quite a bit of inventory, so we're quite busy in terms of, of actually finding that stock to sell. Um, we've been advertising some very large uh, and high value transactions uh, and there seems to be a lot of market interest in them. Uh, I mean, two of the big shopping centers that we're selling are one the Lone Hill Mall and the other one the, the Ballet Mall. And um, that started the year from the bang. Uh, all, all departments are, are working quite hard. Um, obviously our legal divisions are, are the most busy, uh, but commercially is, is, is going quite busy as well. Um, in, in terms of the market, um, I think that there's, there's, a, there's, a, there's a sort of a variance of opinion of what 2011 is going to bring. You know, I, I sort of call it the year of trophy and trauma. Uh, in other words, your trophy type of properties are going to be attracting huge demand, uh, and possibly largely on the commercial property side. So that's properties which are well let, uh, properties which are in prime areas. Uh, those, are th those trophy properties are going to be presenting uh, great opportunities for sellers uh, because people are looking for income um, and so trophy properties are probably going to be sold at higher prices than we've seen um, in years uh, and we're already seeing that I mean, with, with such low interest rates uh, you, you're tending to find that people are looking for income uh, they don't want to keep money in the bank uh, people who have that sort of access to funding and they're looking for those deals and so we're seeing yields drop and we're seeing higher prices being paid that's on the positive side on the negative side uh, the, the, what we call the trauma properties. Uh, those are ones which are in areas which are overdeveloped in parts of the city uh, and, and that, that people don't really want um, and in areas which are oversupplied. And then of course on the commercial property side, those are those vacancies. People don't want vacant properties and that's where we're going to see some trauma. And so really uh, I think the theme of this year will be trophy and trauma, um, which is something that, um, that Auction Alliance gets involved in on both aspects. Uh, on the residential property side, yeah, I mean, the, the new seems to the market seems to be bumping along. Uh, we're starting to see a couple of very luxury homes. Uh, we were out yesterday looking at some luxury homes uh, which are coming into the market. Unfortunately, many of them are distressed. Um, and I think we're going to see more of those sort of properties. Uh, good news or bad news for 2011? Well, it'd be some nice indicators. Uh, I, th I think that, that some of the really good indicators uh, that have come out is. Uh, uh, possibly everyone thought there'd be some sort of uh, Euro sovereign crisis um, this year, and particularly in, in Portugal, and that hasn't proven to be. Uh, it looks like it's been contained in Ireland, and that means that uh, sort of the very bad news isn't coming out for 2011. Um, Germany seems to be doing well, developing economies seem to be doing well, uh, although the RAND has weakened a bit, the, the, the JSE is particularly strong, uh, manuf manufacturing numbers came out recently, that was good. Um, and uh, we've seen some other nice uh, numbers coming up. The retail numbers uh, don't look that bad that have been coming out. And so really the, the, the business sentiment in South Africa is quite good. And we're finding that with our investors. Uh, investors are, are out and they're shopping. And so uh, January has been an interesting kickoff to the year. And uh, we've had a couple of auctions uh, and they've been quite good results. We were, we were quite surprised on a few of our auctions so far. Um, sold some luxury properties uh, and we sold a whole, we did a whole lot of residential properties last Saturday, which were pretty good. And so I think 2011, uh, uh, the year of the rapid, uh, starts with great optimism.